Hi everyone. Um, I'm going to do my miscarriage story, and it's probably going to be in a few parts because I'm going to do um, like how I felt for the beginning of my pregnancy, and then what happened. So, um, I my last the first day of my last period was January 16th. And I took a pregnancy test on February 16th, and a pro and I had implantation bleeding, like probably a week before the 16th, like a week or a week and a half before the 16th, like pretty much right away. Like it was just like a day or two of extremely light pink, and so that was my first. Um, sign that I thought that I was pregnant, and then I didn't want to take a pregnancy test on the 16th. We were, that day we were leaving to drive to where our family lives for my son's birthday, which was on the 19th of February. And I didn't want to take a pregnancy test because I didn't want to be pregnant for his birthday, and I didn't want it to overshadow his birthday. But my husband insisted. So I took a pregnancy test that morning on the 16th, and it was positive. And we were super, super excited. And on the 17th, I told my parents and my sister. And then I think it was the 18th that we po told his family. And we had made a shirt that said Big Brother on it. Or no, maybe it, I think it was Friday. I think it was the 18th we told his family. And we had made, or I had made, a shirt that said Big Brother on it. And we put it on him when we took him over to their house. And my husband just, like, handed my son to his mom. And she, like, looked at the shirt and was like, oh, who gave you that? And then she realized what it meant. So, and his older sister had taken it, was, like, taking pictures of him because she got a new phone. And she didn't realize that you could see what his shirt said in the picture, and so she posted it on her Facebook, and so the rest of his side of the family found out that way. And so on his birthday, they all were like, oh, congratulations, because we were going to wait to tell, we just wanted to tell our immediate family before his birthday, and then wait to tell everybody else after his birthday, because we didn't want it to be like a, oh, yay for the second baby thing, and, you know, overshadowing my son's first birthday. So... Then, um, I had some nausea, like, the first week, like, barely any, and that concerned me because I wasn't nauseous, and I was so, so nauseous with my son when I was pregnant. So, that kind of concerned me that I wasn't, had any morning sickness, but I thought, oh, you know, every pregnancy is different, and that's what they say, so this one must be be different and maybe my body's used to this hormone change so it's not going to react the same and so I was a little bit nervous but really from the beginning I was just so super excited because all I could remember about pregnancy was the very end of pregnancy with my son and how amazing it was to feel the baby kick and him being born and having a huge big round belly that was awesome so because with my son I was very scared of having a miscarriage. I was very scared of things going wrong. I didn't know what to expect. I was, like, really scared, at least in the beginning. So I really wasn't that scared this 